My name is Swati Sanyal. I'm the Director of Operations of Edu Global. Edu Global is a London and Kolkata based education consultancy who basically deals up with international education and we have come here to announce a collaboration which has happened with Sanjeevan Hospital and Lincoln University College Malaysia. Uh, this is a unique uh, one of a kind of collaboration which is happening in India for the first time. Uh, Lincoln University College uh, Malaysia has set up their offshore campus in India which is like that's the reason they have done the tie up with Sanjeevan Hospital. Sanjeevan Hospital is the felicitator who will be you know prom uh, promoting this program and uh, this program th this program is basically it's a doctor of medicine which is equivalent to MBBS pro in India it's a five-year program and the basic eligibility that is needed for joining this program is that you have to secure 50 percent marks in PCB in class 12 and definitely you have to clear NEET but the NEET score what is needed is you have to for general category you have to get 134 and for STSC, OBC or other other classes you have to get 107. We will be also training our students for different screening examinations like FMG, PLAB, USMLE and definitely we are trying to you know uh, enhance the education system. We are trying to get more numbers of doctors for our country and that is the reason we have done this we have gone for this collaboration and uh, we have got a lot of inquiries from Chennai as well last year we have started this program we have 65 students who are already pursuing this course and they have completed their first year this is the second year where we have been allotted with 100 seats from Lincoln University College so we are here to promote it to create awareness about that that now doctor of medicine is not a tough job to get into so if you are meritorious definitely we are also planning to get some scholarships programs for you and uh, that's all thank you this is a doctor of medicine which is equivalent to MBBS in India so what has been happening that students uh, like I I'll just give you a basic figure that we have 70,000 seats for uh, MBBS in India including the private and uh, government but more than 8 lakhs you know, uh, <coughs> students appear every year for those 70,000 seats. So obviously they don't have that opportunity to study MBBS in India. I mean, not all. So that's why they go abroad. Like the popular countries uh, for this particular course is uh, Russia, China, uh, Georgia, Ukraine. So mostly students face a lot of issues there. One is the weather issue, the second is the uh, language issue because English, though English is the main you know, uh, course which is being uh, studied there but the, they can't speak in English while they are outside of the campus. So the parents they worry about their offsprings a lot about this so that's why this has been a regular problem for particular this doctor of medicine or MBBS course in India. So Lincoln University uh, Malaysia, they are MCI ranked. So if you go to MCI website, they are uh, affiliated with uh, Medical Council of India. It's uh, 144 number in MCI website. So this is a offshore campus for Lincoln University College Malaysia. Now, whoever is studying in this particular stream, it's a five year course. The course fee is 50 lakhs for five years and the hostel and other facilities are separate. So you need to, the student once uh, he passes out from uh, Lincoln Medical College, uh, this particular course, he has to appear for the exit uh, entrance, uh, exit exam for MCI, which is called FM, FMG. So you have to appear, so you need to, if you want to practice in India, you have to pass that exam like other you know foreign uh, or international degrees like it's same like international degrees if you are doing it from Ukraine or Russia wherever you want to practice you have to sit for an entrance examination screening test like if you want to practice in UK you have to go for CLAB if you want to go for US you have to sit for USMLE so the same thing if you want to practice in India you have to sit for FMG and the basic criteria for uh, this course is that you need to appear for that 
NEET exam, which is the entrance exam. For general category, the minimum score you need to obtain 134. And for other class like SC, ST, OBC, for other category classes, you, you need to have 107. That is a basic number. So the reason we are you know, here, because uh, last year we have started this course, we already have 65 students with us. This year the seat has been increased, the seat number has been increased to 100. And uh, incidentally, we have received a lot of calls from uh, Tamil Nadu. And uh, we can say that we have a student here who has taken admission today itself uh, from Chennai. So we have received a lot of calls from uh, you know various parts of Tamil Nadu for this particular course. And uh, that is the reason we thought that we would come and we would uh, you know speak about the course. Because last year, it was the first year for us, we thought that let us you know, give some time to our students. The students mostly, you know, last year came from uh, eastern part of India, like uh, Bihar, Jharkhand, Odisha, and Northeast. But this year, we have started receiving calls from southern India, like Karnataka, Kerala. Today also, we have received a lot of calls, inquiries from Kochi, Trishur. So, and uh, obviously Chennai, like uh, we have a lot of students are in the pipeline. They have already called us up, and one of them, uh, sorry, I didn't get your name. So he has taken admission today uh, to our course. So this is first of its kind in India because we are talking. I mean, telling our the parents that you don't need to send your students outside. I mean, your son or daughter outside India that they don't know to. I mean, they can actually have the feeling of homeland and uh, you know they can study in Kolkata. If this particular campus is around. 30 minutes away from uh, Kolkata airport. The location called is Ulubedia, Kuleshwar. So this is a, under the district of Howrah, which is called a twin city for, uh, you know, Kolkata and Howrah are the twin cities. And we have a state-of-the-art hospital, uh, you know, hospitality facility, uh, hostel facility. And this Sanjeevan hospital, which has been running for last 10 years, and uh, we have more than 300 beds at this hospital and it's a super specialty hospital in Howrah and uh, we are affiliated with government of West Bengal health scheme uh, which is called Swastha Sathi so uh, I mean that we have been running for few last few years and uh, the owner of this hospital he is a very renowned oncologist from Glasgow, Scotland and uh, our company Edu Global where me and Swati are the directors so we are based out of London and Kolkata uh, like I live in London and Swati is based out of Kolkata and we have seen that like I told you earlier the students they actually face a lot of problems when they go when they go abroad and study abroad whether I mean environment the uh, you know racial issues a lot of things they face so here they would have the opportunity to study in India and obtain an international degree this is an offshore campus for Lincoln University College, Malaysia. Shonjiban Hospital is just the facilitator. They are, they are pro providing the labs, they are providing the infrastructure, the hospital facilities, but the faculty.